I'm taking you coins. Oh gosh. So we're finally back on the path. And we made it to Dry Dry Outpost. Wow, he took off in a hurry. One coin from this strange red palm tree. Are you from Town? Wow, that's a ways away. Tried your roads? Nope, never heard of it. Sounds like a local fairy tale or something. Hey, if you're serious about looking for dry dry whatever, you should go ask the information trader. Supposedly, this information trader lives in town and swaps information for items or something along those lines. That's what my friend says. My friend? This guy? Nah, he's way too shy to be an information trader. Ha. So anyways, uh, I think it's this guy. Master Mustafa is the main man, yeah, Mr. Mustafa is the main man, ooh. Where's the man? No one knows, he stays hidden from his foes. Are you aware that there's a do Ojo in Toe Town? There is! A while ago I took one of the Dojo challenges and did pretty well, I must say. I got a second degree card. You look pretty strong, so... Huh? You haven't heard any cards? We will be getting to that probably when we head back to Toe Town next. So we have one of our uh, Colorado's bed in here. And let's check our coins here. Anyways, a little secret back here. We'll hop over these crates and we find another one of Merlin's family. Very useful though. Probably, probably in my opinion, the most useful. I'm Merle, you see? That's me! A cuter gal you'll never see. I do magic, but not for free. Your luck has steered you well, for I'm a master of the spell. When my spell upon you glows, you might get lucky. But who knows? Do you dare to take a chance? Want to watch my guards dance? Oh, how lovely. Very good. Just pick one now, if you would. I'd pay as much as I could. The Pete, eh. Look, the petite chorus... Five, for 5 coins, ordinary coins for 20 coins, and a special course for 50 coins. 50 coins is quite a small price to pay, but the special course will last you a good bit of the game, and you can come back here for a um, refresher if you need it. Well, we're ready. Tally-ho, and here we go. I think you'll find this power might get your foes to cower. It will light your darkest hour. Even should you meet a beast, do not fear, not in the least. My spell makes a famine feast. See you then. Please come again. Goodbye, my friend. So much rhyming, so little time. But now we have been blessed with a special course in magic, which will help us in battle. That guy ran off really fast. And this guy's shady. Someone who gives things that's nice. Yes, very nice. Very nice. Nice guys get called nice stuff. Uh, uh. Let's just go ahead and give him a lemon. Oh, heavenly, a lemon, the nicest of nice things. You have proven you're nice by giving my, me my favorite thing. You can give him anything and you can, um, ask him about anything, pretty much. But lemon is his favorite thing. So, and you could just say it's not necessary. Look, his favorite food, which is how you know how to get the lemon after giving him something else. But we need to see the information trader, Mr. Mustafa. To find Mr. Mustafa, go to the shop in this town. First buy a dried shroom, then buy a dusty hammer. You must buy them in the correct order, yes? Remember, dried shroom first, and then dusty hammer. This is a secret sign known only to those loyal to Mustafa. If you buy these things in the correct order, the owner of the shop will let you see Mr. Mustafa. Remember, you must buy it, not buy them in the incorrect order. If you still seek knowledge, you must give me something more. Yes, you understand? Well, goodbye. I wish you luck in finding Mr. Mustafa, nice guy. Quite shady indeed. So, let's go to the shop here. Mr. Shop Owner. Right. So he said, 
Dry Chewin, which is two coins. And then the Dusty Hammer, which is also two coins. You've got to be kidding me. Well, alright. Let's just try to sell that Dry Chewin back to him, I guess. I think this will work. And Dusty Hammer will be two coins. What ho! Buying a dusty tremor after a dried shroom is a secret sign of that only friends Mr. Mustafa must no. Hold on. That means you're in with Mustafa. Yes, the um, L button on the game controller will scroll backwards and the R button well, nothing. A button will still scroll forward. Hey brother, good to meet you. Have you have any questions you need to answer? You wanna see Mr. F Mustafa? He's usually up on the highest part of dry dry outputs. Just keep going up, my man. Thank you. And we're just three star points away. Maybe we should get into a battle with a bandit at some point. Uh, he's gone. So let's just go in through here, I guess. And keep heading up, my friend. Ooh, a letter. A letter to the traveling nomadi mouse. Nomadi mouse. On the road. However you pronounce it. And jump! I used to use paracarry to get over that, but then I can jump. Hey, buddy. You live here? Hey, nice guy. We meet again. I'm glad you found me. Whoosh. I'm Mustafa. I'm the one you've been seeking all this time. When I'm out and about in the dry, dry outpost, I use the name Sheik. It's always good to meet a genuinely nice guy. I meet people all the time, but you are by far the nicest guy I've met so far. I only gave you one lemon. Your name is Mario, yes? I heard you want to go to Dry Dry Ruins. I have a feeling you are on an important journey, so I will tell you the secret. Dry Dry Ruins is a very important place. My ancestors have watched over for many generations. If I do not keep evil folk out of the ruins, who will? You must promise me that you will tell no one this secret. I'll give you this. We got the pull stone! The closer you get to Dry Dry Ruins, the faster it flashes. This pull stone is the key to finding Dry Dry Ruins. Take it to the desert, yes? The pull stone will flash above your head as you get close to the ruins. The closer you get to the ruins, the faster the pull stone will flash. Follow where it leads you. Find the place where the pole stone flashes the fastest, and use it to open the way. Right. So we head out in search of dry, dry ruins. Be, ooh, Chuck Quizmo. Ka Wiz! It's everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo. Wanna try the quiz? Then let's go to the question. Question. What is the color of the block you can break with the first hammer you got? The first hammer? Well, we still have the hammer, so... Cheese cubes! Correct! Congratulations! Here's your star piece. Star piece! You've correctly answered two questions so far. Good luck next time. Well, well, so long, farewell, till we meet again! Right, and just disappears without a trace. So let's head back on out, and probably get Paracarry back out because we have a letter to deliver as well, which should be in this next scene here. Should be. Okay, I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. Hey, look, Pulsestone. There you are. Hello, fellow travelers. I'm in the middle of a journey just as you appear to be. If you go southeast from here, you will reach a beautiful desert oasis, where lemon and lime trees grow. It's nice and cool. It's really the best place to have a rest when many enemies plague the surrounding area. If you plan on reaching the oasis in one piece, be careful. Traveling Nomadi Mouse, correct? The name's Paracarry. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Ouch. Another letter duly delivered. Postman's job is never done. A letter for me? 
Musafa. I heard the name, but I can't remember who he is. Anyway, thank you for delivering it. I'm surprised that you found me way out here. It's extremely hot traveling in the desert, so take care. Oh yeah, take this as my thanks. Don't hesitate, please take it. A star piece, thank you! Letters result in rewards. Sometimes good, sometimes... Eh. So anyways, we need to follow our nose wherever it goes, or the stone wherever it goes. Uh, I forgot the exact location. Oh god, tweezers. They'll teleport you to a different location, depending on which tweezer you actually hit. Starting to flash faster. I heard something. Fire flower. Uh, I'm sorry, Dusty Hammer. Whoa. That'll work. Time to test out Power Bomb. Strike. Six damage, complete incineration, but it does do six FP. And the blessing. The spell will increase the star points you earn. So therefore doubling it, giving us 18 star points. Rebel up! Right, we're gonna increase the nine, then we're gonna start working on FP and HP. So let's go in here and equip a couple more badges. So just Quake Hammer and I suppose multi bounce. So let's head on out before we get poked in the butt by Pokey here. There's three Pokies here. Is it this one? No. Wasn't even close that way, it slowed down. But is that the northernmost part of Dry Dry Ruins? And we have found it. This is the passes. And we can place the pole stone here. Whoa, the rock sank. Earthquake! What's going on? It got all dark. Oh god. Well, we made it. We found dry dry ruins. But, before we go in, we're, I'm going to have to end it for here here for today. In the next episode, we are going to enter Dry Dry Ruins and see what mysteries it holds. Until then, I've been Chaos SR, and I'm signing out. I will see you guys next episode.